What's up everybody, I'm Kethafly and welcome back to Dying Light. So today we're gonna be doing like a bunch of basically just kinda like fetch quests and stuff like that since that's pretty much all we got side quest wise as you can see it's all just grabbing stuff. So we're just gonna start with uh you know go down the line with it basically. I apologize if you can hear a lot of background noise. I can't really stop the people outside of there. But hopefully you guys won't have to hear it too much. I really need to switch out of this freaking shotgun. I don't really want to be going around using up whatever ammo I have left in it. And you pull. There we go. That'll work. Now I need to repair this anyways. And just make sure everything is good. Yep, we're looking good. Alright. Uh, so I marked this area over here because I'm going off of uh, what people are showing on the map and stuff like that since uh, you know, makes it easier and I'm not running around as much. Let's go get this. So they were going- there should be a pharmacy in this general area. Oh, there it is right there. Oops. Actually, I pushed a Q. That's alright. Now they can't get in, apparently. I thought I was gonna have to prepare to fight some uh, some zombies. Okay. Alright, so we got the gauze we need. We need more painkillers. Hurry up, train. We gotta get him back. Dude, listen, I'm I'm assuming this is not a timed thing because it isn't showing a time. Let me just make sure just to be on the safe side. There wasn't like a... I think. Yeah, there's no timer on it. I, they would put a timer on it if there was a timed event kind of thing. I think all it's gonna be is just Brecken yelling at us about it. I'm not going back out that way. I believe... Yeah, there's nothing really else here. Yeah, no, that's all we can get from here. So, I will get to a safe place and then look at the next place he went to because I know for a fact that he did go someplace after this. I'm just trying to think if... I think he got all the painkillers here, so I hope it won't be a problem. Whatever, we'll figure it out if it is a problem. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. So, uh, from what I understand, it's just, you know, hitting different pharmacies. I can't really find a good source for, like, all the different pharmacies so I can see if this is the closest one or not but I just showed you guys the one I marked that's what he marked and so I'm just hoping that uh it'll give me what I need and I don't have to do too much running around because honestly it'd be better if I can just you know get it done as minimal as possible just so that way I'm not doing as much cutting and uh there's not as much me just running around trying to find freaking pharmacies. Come on, get your stamina back up. There you go. So we need three painkillers and three syringes. I hope this isn't gonna be too big of a problem for me because the guy I was watching, I believe it's dated. Stop eating termites off that stick and get here immediately. Was that simple enough? Yes, but you are holding down the talk budget. And who told you you could use my radio? The same person who told you you could eat my sandwich. You were supposed to make lunch for both of us. Make your own lunch, you Cliff Notes intellectual. Where the hell are you? Have you gone after Sarah? What the hell are you waiting for? Oh, for the love of God, both of them. Jesus Christ. I get it, Brecken. You want me to freaking go and take care of it. Have a little bit of patience, my man. Jesus. I get it. You need him back. Alright. Seriously? Alright, fine. You wanna line up and get you beaten? Don't hit the freaking. No, no. Oh, oh god. Can he hit me? He can't. Actually, you know, why don't I just get you guys out here? There you go. Oh, for the love of- 
I'm getting around you. Alright, I need to get up here anyways, because I believe... Actually, no, it wasn't that you got up here, you went the other way around, but... Ah, I can't, alright. So we need to get to the other side of the pharmacy. To get, uh, on the other side of that door. At least that's what it looked like the person did. I don't. Ah, oh, jeez. Did this get changed? Oh god, get, get, get out of my way! It's a horrible place, Jesus. He's freaking. Okay, so. When he was in here, he did the ping. And there was something. Yeah, in there. But. There was no- What? Oh, for the love of- Alright. What is supposed to be the access point for this? Looked like he just wrapped around, but that didn't really work. Oh my god. And I'm on the ground now. Wonderful. Okay, Jesus. I'm about to say- that I'm just done with this pharmacy. Yeah, I can't even get anything done on these doors. You know what? Yeah, I'm just gonna say screw this pharmacy and move on to a different one. Alright, well I will be back once I have figured out the next pharmacy to go to. Alright, I'm back. So apparently the next pharmacy that they wanted me to go to is like on the other side of the map and stuff like that technically. So instead we're just gonna go up here and uh, get like report to Tolga. Oh my god. Sorry about that. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Since uh, we're over here anyways and I don't know why they freaking did that. They could have done a better job with it but whatever. I won't complain too much. Just get to Tolga and figure out what god's name they want now. I assume another difficult feat. But you know, they pay well at least. Or I, I think I remember them paying well. I don't know, it, it's been a hot minute. I took a bit of a uh, vacation. And so I had like recorded a lot of stuff ahead of time. And so now I'm just kind of like a little uh, forgetful of all I've done. I remember this person though. Uh, still scares me that the fact that they just suddenly showed up because I know I took this path beforehand and they weren't there and then suddenly they were. Just uh, a bit scary. All right, where are you two? I'm guessing in the village? Yeah, it looks like they're in the village. I wonder how they get around so easily, you know? They don't seem like they're very, uh... physically capable of doing many things. They just- they seem like they're the brains of the operation, so I'm assuming somebody, like, helps them around? I don't know. Maybe I'm just assuming things and they can do it just fine. I will be right back. Sorry about that. Apparently I'm recording at the worst time humanly possible. If, if it happens again, which it might, I apologize. Alright, where are you two idiots at? There you guys are. What do you need Good now? Good to see you again, Mr... Uh, what's his name? Crane, like the mindless machine that lifts heavy things. Just tell me what you need and I'll be on my way. <sighs> duct tape. Uh, cables. We need ten rolls of duct tape. No, we need ten power cables. Duct tape. Cables! Duct tape. Cables! Duct tape! Look, I get it. You need both. Precisely. Precisely. And that concludes talking to you. Get going! Yeah, I, I... I got four. We got four of both. <laughs> I, what a coincidence. Okay, so we need to get six more. I'll Ooh, hold on to it until I get all of it, because I'm... I, I like avoiding them as much humanly possible. Besides, they're probably both going to be like, well, why didn't you get us all of it when we needed it? Uh, Oh, they, they actually marked on the map where I can get these things unlike the rest of the quest. Which makes my life easier and for that reason I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. 
Yeah, yeah, I don't need to sell anything. I was considering possibly selling stuff, but I don't think I need to currently. I think I just need to... I think I'll go north first. Yeah, we'll go this way. Please tell me these areas that they're guiding me to isn't absolutely infested. It might be. Be honest, if I just had all the materials, this would be like the easiest quest in the world, but... Alas, I do not have everything I need. It's not like the, uh, the drunken quest where I have like a crap ton of alcohol for no apparent reason, you know? Oh, great. Come on. Get your beatings. Oh, but we can die. Thank you. I hate how it, uh, like, just by virtue of me, like, being near them, it zaps me. Alright, because I don't want to deal with you. Uh,. Honestly, I don't even think I need to use the, uh... No, for them I do, though. He's slow enough where I can just kind of run around him and get what I need. Or at least I should be able to. Where's he at? There's the big guy at. Ooh, that is... C that was a good one. I love just watching them just get completely demolished. I don't even know how I managed to get her arm cut off too because it didn't seem like she was in a position for that. But you know what? Listen, it's like, uh, uh, what's Bloody Mess, that's what it is from Fallout, where they just freaking explode into a, a bloodbath. Don't try and bite me. Oh god. I still got bit. Jeez, she really took a chunk. Okay, I'm done with you people. Get over there. Leave me be. Oh, come on. Nine? Where's the last one? Go over there. <laughs> he smacked him. Oh, there it is. I'm gonna have to get the cable. Uh, cable? Cable. I can't speak today. Everything's falling apart. Get, get out of crouching. Thank you. Jesus. Uh, God. Nothing wants to work with me today. It's an absolute disaster. Alright, where to next? Um, I am. Straight up south. Perfect. The simpler the better. Come on, get up there. Now, what is going to be greeting me this time? More big guy? I don't really mind him too much now. Like, he's a nuisance, but you know, it's, he's not the biggest nuisance in this game. That is for sure. We all know how I feel about the spitters. Alright. Is this inside? Can I close this? Thank you. Anybody home? Apparently not. Ooh, duct tape. Would you look at that? They're telling me to go down, but I'm already getting the duct tape I need. Not all of it, of course, but a decent chunk. All of it counts. And nothing else up here. Doesn't seem like it. Yeah, no, it's all underneath. Other metal parts and nails. I think I've been short on those, so that helps me a lot. 
But it's not exactly what I'm here for. So where exactly is that? Oh, great. One second. Uh, this episode of uh, Dying Light is brought to you by never-ending interruptions. This time it was the dogs. Which is more of a, uh, a typical one. We see that a lot more often than other things. Oh. So this isn't outside. Okay, I should have known that. If I just looked at the minimap, I would know, but of course I'm a fool that does not look at the minimap. Alright, come on. Just. There we go. I just needed to break a lockpick before I decided to. What? What? Oh, God. Can I just, like, throw a firecracker in there? I think, I think that's all it was about. Okay, we're safe. For the most part. Got a bunch of volatiles around, but they, luckily they are not smart enough to open up doors. So, I'll just have to deal with them when I leave. But you know, like, it's easier to run away from them than it is to deal with them in like a confined space. to be, uh, safe. Alright, let's get all this stuff. Ooh, my gosh. I'm gonna need it. Since they're gonna be depriving me of some of my gauze already. Give me all the goodies. Alright. Oh, even more. Jesus, like, this is like duct tape heaven. Alright. Alright, so there's nothing else in this area. What we'll do is we'll go back to Tolga and stuff and I'll probably cut off the video there. Hopefully that's enough. Should be. But you know... There's always that uh, thought of maybe it's not. Okay, we're gonna go through this door since it seems like the safer of the options. Don't know what that was about, but okay. No. Leave me be. We're making the uh, long trek around this way again. Oh god, no, I might die. Okay, I'm not dead, alright. It's a good thing I really did invest points in the uh, fall damage thing, because I probably would have died from that if I didn't. It was a worthy investment since I am a giant idiot that uh, just just can't help falling nearly to her death. Hello. We're gonna call you Amanda. Every time we come by her, we'll just say hi, Amanda. <laughs> Alright. Time to give the twins their duct tape and power cables. Wonder what uh, amazing creation they're... Uh, doing now. Was it the first one? The uh... No, no, no. I was thinking, like, I was thinking the uh... the cords that you travel by. But now I think about it. Maybe it was, maybe it wasn't. I can't remember if that was already a thing or not. I... My memory is uh... severely lacking, unfortunately. Alright. Here's your cables. And here's your duct tape. Ten rolls of duct tape, ten cables. You've done well, Simeon. You are performing far beyond your capabilities. Of course, they say to improve your game, you should play with someone better than yourself. Clearly, contact with Tolga and I has significantly increased your intelligence. So, you are welcome. <sighs> One more task and we will be done. Oh, what do you need? There is a military base on the other side of the Collapse Bridge. You will zip line across to it. Using the borrowed intelligence we have imbued you with, you will find a military-grade mobile sonar unit. Bring it to us. Bring it to us. Mr. Dahl will want to see you as well, so please, use some deodorant, and try not to drool on yourself so much. 
All right, get going. Watching you is painful. Is that moss growing on you again? Start moving. Maybe he'll move if we look away. General relativity states that all things are in motion, but somehow you are not. <sighs> Jesus, I, mm. oh, that's, I, I don't like the thoughts of having to go onto a military base. I just don't like that, especially for the fact that I had to cross the bridge to get to it. You know, there's that mess and then there's the mess of it being a military base, which I'm sure is just going to be fantastic. But that is going to be for the next video. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you want to see more from me, why not subscribe? And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye.